uh, La Fonda Hotel. Uh, we're in uh, Santa Fe, New Mexico, 180 room hotel, 100 year old hotel. And we employ about 185 full time employees at this point in time. Uh, and we do know about 85% of those employees are vaccinated because early on, uh, we had uh, we had allowed our employees not to wear masks if they were vaccinated. So now there's a statewide mask mandate again in New Mexico. So that is no longer the case. But we were in the front line saying you must wear a mask to enter this property, and we got some pushback on that. But it was it's been far worse being the vaccine police because you can't visibly see if somebody's been vaccinated or not. So you just have to take their word for it, and that. It just it doesn't sit well with me. It just has made me uneasy that I'm exposing my 185 employees to people that may not be vaccinated and may not be wearing the mask. So now with the federal government saying, yes, this is something that will be necessary, I think we will move ahead. And I, I think there'll be broad acceptance and approval of this going across. We, I was a little worried if I mandated it just for my hotel and I had 12, 15 people, whatever, say, I don't want to get a vaccine, they would go to my competition. And with the seriousness of our staffing issues already, that was a no-go. That was a no-starter from the very beginning. So this mandate will help us across the board. It's a big number. And, you know, like I said, having my staff vaccinated is one thing, and that's great, and I'll be very happy about that. But also knowing that a lot of people walking through our doors are working for bigger employers, hopefully, and are also vaccinated. You know, without a mandate like this, we were never going to get to that herd immunity. And I think that's critical that we do that. And uh, hopefully this eases it up. I was very depressed the, the day that New Mexico announced we had to put masks back on uh, whenever we were indoors. That was I did not want to backslide into that situation. But we put ourselves here, unfortunately, uh, as a country.